How's it going, boys? So today we are playing the Golden Age of the Counter Spell deck. So yes, Kaladesh gave us something extremely sweet. Disallow and Oven Bun. If you do not know this Planeswalker, it is effectively 100% more annoying than a Tefari Planeswalker because his emblem does not exile things. No, 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 no. His emblem makes it so you can only untap two things per turn, which essentially means your deck becomes useless. And above everything, there's already counter spells, so it's double the useless, technically. And if that's not enough, here's a Jace. So we have two Fey of Fishes, four Javri Disruption, four Quench, two Search for a Skunt, four Dovin's Vetos, four Disallows. And Disallows is the most magical counter spell card there is. Because it can uh, cancel a creature's activated ability, it can cancel an emblem, it can cancel literally anything. So, it is 100% amazing. Uh, two Narsets, four Supreme Wills, four Ab Absorbs, two Rats of God, two Dovin Buns, two Fumigate. Fumigate, the golden card against aggro decks. If you have five mana on curve and you drop a Fumigate against a red deck, there are chances you survive. Because it gives you HP, and sometimes that HP is all the difference you need. Two Jaces and two Torrential Gear Hulks. Oh yes, only two Torrential Gear Hulks. It is an extremely good card. You're gonna see why. Because we can cast Fumigates, and it's an easy win condition, honestly, for Counterspell decks. Because it doubles as a blocker, it doubles as face-hitting material, it doubles as a Counterspell, it uh, doubles as a Wrath. It doubles literally as everything and anything. So that's the huge upside of this. And we have a sideboard. Clear, clear the mind, excellence, binding, and a bunch of MacGuffins. Nothing honestly too special right there. So, 25 lands, by the way, to be specific. Because we, we, we kind of want mana, I guess. I don't know. That's just the way I did. Run with 24 lands if you want. But there's a lot of aggro decks currently out there. So we're just going to do it as is. So, without any further ado, let's just get a cracking and see what happens. And yes, people will tell me that in in the Alpha or Beta or whatever version of Magic the Gathering Arena, uh, it the classical counterspell deck was uh, black and blue, because of Raska's Contempt and all of those cards. It is true. It is 100% true. Oh, we go first. Noise. So, four lands, Fig of Wishes. A little bit of good old kisses. Uh, three counter spells in hand. <clears throat> Feeling mighty fine about that. Oh, someone's already using the vine Vinding Constructor. God, that's one hell of a stupid card. I hate it. So, it needs to go bye-bye. That's the oldest, by the way, uh, deck in the book. Not gonna lie. This thing. Okay, so... If one or more counters will be put on an artifact or creature you control, double that shit up. It is ludicrously annoying. And it is ludicrously overpowered with things like uh, Wild Growth Walkers. And this is where we actually start to search for things outside of our deck. End of the story. Not the best, honestly, but yeah. Should have put Glimmer of Genius on one hand in the deck, because that would be absolutely 100% lovely, but I sadly could not. Glimmer of Genius, one of the better uh, draw cards, because it has Scry too. Oh yes, and it draws too, and the art is phenomenal. But yeah, currently it's going pretty well. This is a Bolas Citadel deck, by the way, if anyone has not noticed. We're gonna be making a lot better Bolas Citadel deck, by the way, boys. Do, do not worry your little, your, your, your little minds. We do not care about those things. Supreme Wills, honestly, kinda useful, but now nah, I'm gonna just say no. Okay, that's a little bit a lot less useful than uh, what I wanted, but hey, that's just life. Okay, so let's see it to believe it. Are you gonna sit it all now? No! It's a... Oh god, that's bad. Well, yeah, 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 whatever. Let, let, let's see what happens. What that are you top decking? Ooh! That's pretty cheek right there, boys. That's also a 5-4. Murphone Branchwalker. Disgusting. Anyway, time to Supreme Will something. Let's see what we get. Honestly, I don't like any of these options. 
Our best one is probably not Fumigate even. Interesting, huh? Okay, Fumigate not the option of the best currently, but we do have other things. And then there's Supreme Will. Okay, do we drop this because reasons? Nah. Okay, he gets this. Uh, increase counters on stuff. Not exactly useful. And currently, as sad as this is, this is fine-ish. Let's see what enemy Kun decides to do. Nothing! What a Chad, what a lad. I like him. Not really, but hey. Oh, look at that! A Jace. Suddenly the prophecy is self-fulfilling. Uh, that can go into the graveyard. Transform. That's great. Disallow, huh? I'm gonna just do this, because we need to get a little bit of time, almost. There we go. Do I want a land? Actually, yes, I do. We have not played a land, and that allows us to cast the Dobbins Veto. Okay, that's pretty good. All I'm kind of uh, hoping to not see is a Citadel. Oh, uh, do I risk it? Because that means Jesu Kunu is deadu. Nah, I'm not gonna risk it. If he gets a Citadel, then this was absolutely fate, boys. Not gonna lie. If he just Citadels us, I have no... Oh, it's just the same thing. Oh, a Ravenous Chupa Macabre. Okay, annoying. Oof. Okay, that's at least counterspellable as, as, as everything. Okay, this guy is now creating servos with that. That's not... That's actually not bad. That's not half bad. Oh, you want that Assassin's Trophy, don't you? Okay, that's completely A-OK. -okay. Uh, I am kind of searching for something uh, with the name of Rat in it. Would be extremely fine. Some might even say Sugoi. I should probably put... Okay, let's see. This gives us options, huh? Well, let's see what we get here. Maybe something sweet. Nope. Okay. Oh, look at that. Exactly what the doctor ordered. Well, we do have a lot of uh, find in this deck, so it's absolutely fine. Okay, so enemy kun, how's life? Probably not that great, huh? You all you got was an assassin's trophy, and that's not exactly gonna cut it. Bam! Disallow. What a time to be alive, boys! And we're slowly but certainly just gonna get ooh into the story. May I actually do some poppity poops. Nice. Seven. Okay, that's 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 exactly the number I honestly was looking for. Okay, that's useful. Uh, what are we looking for now, by the way? Maybe a torrential gear hulk. Well, that would be the easiest and fastest win condition. Drop this as land because we don't ex exactly care too much. Let's be real here, boys. A wrath of God. Why not? It, it it's a card. It's a luxury. And honestly, yeah, we have everything for counter spells. Boys! This is the life. This is the life worth living as they say. Well, that's what I say, but it's fine. Bam! Well, enemy Kun, what now? You're just gonna slowly wither away and, well, essentially just die off. It's gonna be amazing, trust me. I have seen it happen plenty of times. Oh no, I did not draw a citadel of Bolash. What will I do with my life? Well, you're gonna regret it, obviously. Oh, a torrential gear hulk? Yes, why not, baby boo? Okay, time to actually kick it into high gear. God, I love the fact that torrential gear hulk is just a free win condition that already can be main decked. It's absolutely amazing. Also, we could draw more, but I'm gonna kind of be... Okay, that's, that's questionably good. Okay, let's see. We don't exactly have too much, but I'm assuming this is a counter spell draw. Oh, boys, that's a counter spell of the ages. Okay, a little bit more. Why not? Uh, now nah, we already have that. Is he gonna go for the classic yet fantastic play of I am gonna get two cards so you can't counter spell everything I love? Ah, uh, that would be funny. I do not want Wrath of God. We can Torrential Gear Hulk if we so desire, so it's all for, uh, good. Do I want anything? Well, let's search for a uh, for counter right there. Oh, yes. Yeah, enemy can probably does not exactly feel good about his current predicament. Also, that Jace is mighty close to an emblem. And you know what Jace found? A Dovin. You know what Dovin does? Stuff, essentially. That's pretty much it. 
Oh yes, boys. The Dolvin emblem, the every emblem, the whatever. Too bad Dolvin has questionable art, to say the least, honestly. Uh, but I think it's fine. And yes, we're gonna attack the face with fair fishes. I know, I know, it's extremely rare and pretty much heresy for me, but we're gonna do it anyway. Well, enemy kun, what now? You have three cards. What, what a lad. What, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? I can minus two with Jace if I so desire. I can dove in it up. I can do so many things. I don't even need to use search for a scunter there because reasons. Oh, boys. Ah, I guess I'm not gonna go for the land right there. Oh, more and more of those things. Okay, that's fine. Okay, let's see what we can actually get here. Hmm. Ah, might as well do this. Might as well. Might as well do that. Do I care for anything here? Now, let's activate Narset one more extra time. Uh, and get a disallow, because why not? Let's just show enemy on how much we care about him. Uh, we can 100% ditch the Fumigate and the Quench. It's not exactly useful for us now. Slowly, but certainly. I'm just waiting so I can Torrential Gear Hulk something out of existence. You know, a casual need, a casual necessity. <laughs> well, enemy con come on! Come on! Oh, you're gonna play that! Oof, that, that's, that's, that's a big boy! Are you trying to bait me? Because I will 100% take the bait head on. I am that kind of person. There is nothing you can do so I do not get baited. I will absolutely waste everything and anything on this bait enemy con. There is no chance in hell. Well, actually, I counted the man and I see that the quench is usable. Oh, and he just surrenders. <laughs> Amazing. Boys, it's Dovin time. It is 100% Dovin time. Admittedly, it's also playing our bridge time. It's Ulamog time yet again because of the stupid energy combos that you can pull off. It's literally Kaladesh o'clock. And, well... The Kaladesh train has no brakes, boys. It just doesn't. That's scary. Okay. So, ooh, a card. Let's see. And it's garbage. 10 out of 10 magic. I love it. Okay. Onward we go to introduce people to the shenaniganries of Dovin. The card that does kind of arguably bad stuff, but the emblem is beyond annoying. Well, what can you do against this deck? This, the moment you lose against it is the moment you lose against it. Yeah, that does not sound too too smart now, does it? But it's fine. Bam! Start with the Glacial Fortress because we have the MTX. Okay, put the cat on purple. Hello there, enemy Kun. What are you doing? I have five mana in hand. Arguably... What are you doing, enemy Kun? Oh! You know what? I am going to literally do nothing against you. Yeah, I'm going to drop this because I can. So, my plan enemy is simple. I do absolutely nothing against you except counterspell two cards in this deck. There is absolutely no need for me to do absolutely anything else. Also, I'm kind of annoyed how many lands we have. But it's sometimes useful. I didn't expect that, honestly. Why do you have that? Is this just because it draws a card? I actually... Dude, that's way too many stuffs. Okay, uh, do this and find a... Uh, honestly, there's not much I can do. I seriously should uh, put glim glim Glimmer of Genius in the deck. He could actually... Okay. Okay, you have two Narsets. Not cool. Where is my Narset when you need- Oh, okay, that just gets even worse, huh? Well, that was cool. I'm gonna drop this. Bam! What now? I'm gonna kill that Narset. Yeah! <laughs> okay, come on, let's do it. See, see it to believe it. Are you just gonna cast this because why not at this point? It could be. It, it's, it's a possibility, not a probability. Okay. Wait, I'm a counterspell dick, you idiot! You just 
just made my game so much easier. Not gonna lie, a lot easier. Okay, the only bad part is he has not set, I don't. And, well, he does have Elspeth Conqueror's Dead, which is technically a complete fallacy. Uh, there is no way to make yourself play more than one card with Rule of Law, so he is in a disadvantage. I also have a Jace Planeswalker. In somewhere. Uh, yeah, you know what? I am gonna absolutely take the trade here. Two lands are kind of worthless here. Yes, you can get, you can do that. I, I am okay with it. I am 100% okay-ish with that. Also, you're a three-color deck. I, 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 I am rudimentarily interested in what's happening here. Okay, do this. Are you gonna counterspell that enemy con? I think you will. Yep, negate. Okay. This is gonna be an interesting matchup. Supreme will? Yeah, Supreme will. Okay, good luck. Okay, enemy con. <laughs> We're definitely having a questionable game. Can I get something? Well, technically it's fine. Can't do anything with that. So here's the hope that he does nothing, right? Oh, he's gonna try and resurrect the Jace. Oh! Is that your play? Okay, into the story it is. Damn, one card, boys. One play. It's better than nothing, honestly. Okay, I should probably remove one land. Because this is a little bit too much lands. Okay, well, we can we can play this thing out for eternity now. That's 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 a given fact, honestly. Okay, so he has lands, a plains, and everything's useless. If I draw anything, ooh, nope, you're not Elspeth Con Conqueror's debting today. But we are gonna draw a Jace, a Dovin. Honestly, not even that bad, boys. Not even that bad. Yeah, I kind of expected it to get counterspelled, but now, now we're top decking like there's no tomorrow. What a time to be alive. Oh, and now you're gonna do that? Are you gonna notch set again? I think you have another notch set in your hand. Anissa? Wow! No. Well, you decided to go for the rule of law play, and now we're gonna just pretend that we have actually cards in our hand. Oh god! Can I- the travesty. Can I get a search for a Skunta, please? Or a Fae of Fishes, or literally anything. Okay, a Dovins. Okay, drop the land because everyone knows you drew, drew a land. It's pointless to just not po drop lands after you have two cards. No one believes it. Well, we could. This is like the game who first runs out of a deck. <laughs> what, a, what a proud moment in life. Okay, the bad part is we have supreme wills. Yeah, no. How, how about a flat out just to know from Dovin right there? Okay, so the bad part is, okay, Supreme Will. Honestly, I'll take it. Look up. He is definitely out of cards. I can... I can Dovin. Yeah, I can Dovin. That's card advantage. That, that's gonna be card advantage. That's fine. I think he's... Ooh. I should probably not set. And that's game, boys. That is 100% game. Bam, Dovin's Veto. What now, enemy con? Yeah, what, what now? You can't, you can't. You you decided to rule a flaw me, but I have way more counter spells than you. And that's 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 the funzy onesie part, you know? Ah, oh, search for a Skunta. I'm actually gonna drop the Dovin. I want that more. Ah, yes. Now I'm gonna... Make that wall extra useless. Oh. Well, you know what? I'll take it, enemy con. If you want to play it like that, I can't. I, I I cannot say no. And I'm just gonna. Oh, right. Drop search for a Skunda. Oh God, he's just not getting anything. You poor little schmuck. You poor little schmuck. No, says the Dobbins Veto. 
Oh, what a, what a game. Yeah, let's do this. Let's transform. Oh, well, what's that in me? Couldn't you don't have anything left in your deck? Oh, that's so, so sad. Oh, look at that. I have more counter spells left. You know what? I'm just gonna do this. Bam. There's almost a Dobbin emblem right there. What you gonna do, boy? What you gonna do? I'm gonna find that Jace also really soon because I have this. Not finding the Jace, but I am showing him how much of a bigger cock I have than him. And that's not an underestimation, boys. We have absolutely, trividly established dominance because he decided that he's gonna rule of law me. Okay, enemy kun. It's fine. I'm not gonna. Do oh, I should have looked for the Jace, but it's fine. Oh, did you find a. Oh, you know what? Yeah, I actually dropped that. I don't care. You're not gonna draw a card. Yeah, I also have a Narset there. Yeah, surrender. Know your place. You can't play against me with a counter spell deck. I should. I'm gonna remove one land, by the way. But yeah, boys. I may not play this game seriously, but I will play it seriously when I'm playing a counter spell deck because I think that's the only deck that requires actual thought in this game. And the thought is literally limited to do I counter spell or do I rat here? Is it better to draw or do whatever? I know, not exact not exact well, magic is not exactly a complicated game or anything, so I guess it's fine, but yeah. Do I? No, I don't want to get rid of planes. I want to get rid of an island. Okay, and now we're gonna do this a little bit. Well, there's no point of two excellent bindings, I guess. So, let's just go for Glimmer of Genius, because the art is so lovely. Also, well, actually, I'm not gonna tell you about my other plans, but I just wanted a counter spell deck, because, ah, oh, it is the time. It is the time, boys. Everyone's trying to play big oopsie doopsie type of combo wombo decks. And I'm I'm just sitting here saying Dovin Emblem, boys. Dovin Emblem. Ooh. Oh wait, your name is Grim Knight. A generic name with a Liliana avatar does not invoke fear, it invokes sadness. Watch him be something dumb as an aggro deck with not actual red in it. I'm 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 banking on blue. Me, uh, blue something or white? No, no. He's either gonna be a blue deck, green deck, uh, maybe red deck, maybe, maybe white deck, and I think that's all the colors. So I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna fail that one. <laughs> this is fine. It's not fine. God damn it! Honestly, what, 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 what did you did you expect anything else to happen? Wow, I feel duped. Not gonna lie, boys. Okay, ooh, yeah, I can do this now. Bam! Search for a scunt. I'm guessing. Easy money, maybe. Uh, no. I actually want a land. So here it is. It's a land. What do I counterspell? If he's an Ugin deck, I don't literally care at all what happens to him. But if, he, if he's not an Ugin deck, well, then it's kind of a little bit of annoyance. Depends on what he plays. Maybe he's a Fabricate deck. Yeah, probably not. Well, gotta say one thing. If you're playing colorless deck, at least you have Zelfer and Void. And that's honestly, in my opinion, one of the, uh, the by far better cards. Okay, gonna do this. Bam, quenched. Uh, let's see. Oh, sadness can't play the Jace on Curvature. Uh, it's fine, though. I have two counter spells. What are you gonna do? Ugin me? Ha, huh, don't be pitiful. Oh, Inventor's Fair, what a time to be a lot. Do I care? Actually, I kind of do care about this one. This allow. He doesn't have anything else to play. And if he does, it's I don't care because it's uh, 3 mana. I know how that deck looks. And this is annoying because it can't attack my Jace. So, can't exactly let that happen. 
Crucible of Worlds, you say? That's something I did not expect at all. Well, what are you gonna do? Like, use use a use a bunch of blast zones? God, I hope not. That would be seriously annoying. Okay, so I'm currently banking on the fact that that was a safe turn to play Jace and establ establish dominance and advantage. Six mana, we can play two counter spells, Supreme Will, God, uh, Wrath of God. And technically he could play his big turn five, but if he plays his big turn five, it doesn't exactly matter too much to me. The only problem is the blast zone. <clears throat> kind of dislike that part. But there is a huge chance that he has nothing to do. Of all the fucking things in the world! You just randomly had that, didn't you, you little shit? Okay, that's it. We're getting rid of the, we're, we're getting rid of your stuff. Your, your stuff is bad, I dislike it, and uh, Jace is gonna find me a land. Trust me on that one. You're gonna play that thing? No, you're not gonna play that thing. Because Jace is gonna find a white land that's untapped. Observe. Ka-ching! That's how we do it. That's how we do it, boys. And considering that was his power play turn, and he most likely has other things that I don't care about, I think we're absolutely fine. I think he has the Lothar or something to make it. Yeah, that's, that's fine. Forsaken Monument does nothing here. Okay, because next turn it's... Oh, Dovin's Veto Clock. Why not, boys? Why not? I can actually play this, right? Uh, yes, I can play it in extreme relative safety. Noise. Okay, so the worst case scenario is he drops Ulamog. And I can't exactly stop that one. But it's fine, technically. Not really, but I like to lie to myself a lot. Okay, so what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Will we call this a uh, 83 point? Yeah, I kind of expected a fucking Olamog. Okay, you're targeting what? Fay of Fish is in that, huh? Nah, no reason to Supreme Will. Yeah. Obviously on that. Oh, that's really annoying. Uh, I'm actually gonna get that back. And I'm gonna get rid of these two. He has two cards. Even if he has a big dick Ulamog, it doesn't matter. Because we're getting rid of everything he loves. We're drawing a land, boys. Pre-recorded that. <laughs> Pre-recorded did not know what color he's gonna play, yeah. Well, actually, no. Nah, that sounds too stupid even for me. Okay, Heliod, do your magical, uh, cuck things. Cuck, cuck, cuck him in some way, shape, or form, or fashion. We have Supreme Will in hand, we have a, enough mana. It doesn't matter what, what enemy Kun does, he's pretty much done. He has six lands, he can't drop an Ulamog, he can't drop an anything. We can disallow most things. Well, we did already use one disallow. Are you kidding me? I, I, I just stopped that thing from happening and you just do it again. Do you not have anything better to do with your life than be a nuisance? God. Well, say one thing that you will. At least he doesn't have the tome that would give him a uh, card advantage. If he had that, I would lose. Okay, I'm assuming Ulamog clock now. How many? Six cards, okay. Uh, yeah, I obviously can't allow you to do that. Bam. Okay, enemy Kun, anything else you want to add to the mix? Obviously can't allow you to also do that. Are you even listening to me? Does that even do anything? Oh, Torrential Gear Hulk. That's actually real good. 
Oh, uh, yeah, that's gonna be a easy this low. And we still have Mon. Look at the top of the card. Find the Dobbin. Not exactly... Well, I'm gonna bang that he has absolutely nothing of value in his life left. So, I'm gonna do... Now, actually... I'm gonna do the minus, because I want a little bit of... Okay, now this is the perfect turn. Boys! Face. If he drops an Ulamog now, I'm gonna be pretty mad. Or an Ugin. I am pre- I am gonna be extremely displeased with the situation. I have no lands to speak of. There's a Dovin. He's kind of- oh, of course you get an Ugin. You haven't even- how oh, that? Minus four. Assuming minus four. Yep, minus four it is. You know what else I'm gonna assume? That you can't deal with the stupid gear hulk. What does that even do? Okay, time to time to be pretty sneaky peeky cheeky. Uh, so let's let us do this and choose and look. And we just found search for a sconta. We can't exactly use it just yet, but this is fine. Dugan's dead, he can't do anything against the Gear Hulk. Again, boys, Gear Hulk. Pre reasonable uh, card. Until the end of turn. That's bad. Huh. Oh, actually, I never read what that card does. Oh, pre it's pretty decent. Is he gonna pop it? Uh, that would be super annoying. Hmm. If I top deck a disallow, I can stop the card effect. <laughs> that would be pretty good. Okay, Fae of Wishes. Honestly, not bad. Okay, what are we getting, boys? Actually, I don't care what we're, we're I know what we're getting. Sorcerer's Spyglass. Fuck your stupid Ugin. It's top deck city again, boy. As long as he does not top deck now an Ulamog, we should technically be 100% fine. And I have no idea what's Ugin's name. Ugin the Spirit Dragon? Ugin the Spirit Cock. Perfect. Yeah. That's called... Fuck you sincerely. Okay, finally, can we flip the stupid search for a Skunt? No, no attacks because she's, she's just gonna do that. As long as he does not top deck a Ulamog, we're fine. This is completely useless in his little garbage womanly hands. Okay. Yeah, yeah, whatever, boy. Whatever. So, enemy Kun, how's life? Dude, he's going pretty deep, huh? Wait, how do I even stop? Wait, 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 wait. That's becoming dangerous. Yeah, that's seriously becoming dangerous. So, did you top the canoe Ulamog or not? Answer me. Answer me! Also, how, how exactly am I supposed to get rid of that stupid land? I'm not, huh? Okay. Oh! Okay, boys, I feel mistake. Oh, come on! You also have a card in there. Do you not have anything better to do with your life? Also, I forgot he has blast zones. So, technically... <laughs> Why the fuck hasn't he used them? Oh, because he's gonna cuck me with a meteor golem. Disgusting! Dude, all you needed to do was not play the stupid Ulamog. But my Jace was gonna emblem you. Also, wait, what? Oh, because one is dead. For a moment I thought that I lost all Fae of Fishes. Man, all you need to do was not play the stupid Ulamog. So my Jace gets the emblem off and you're completely useless. That, uh, that was the deal. That was what we wanted. That was what we agreed upon. Yeah, you do that. Y you do you, boo. Humbug, what am I supposed to do? Should've put an Immortal Sun in the sideboard, let's be real here. Should've put an Immortal Sun. 
But he he also has forgot he has put blast zones in his deck. That much I know for a fact. Also, by the way, the new color that's one thing that uh, one uh, one cost artifact uh, can do. Oof, that was a really good thing we dodged right there. Uh, Wrath of God, not exactly useful. God damn it. Well, the good part is Dugan doesn't exactly do anything. He's obviously gonna try to stop it, but that's fine. Let's see, what can we actually find here that makes sense? A Jace, you know what? That does make sense. I like it. Okay, what are the chances that he top decks? Well, he might as well easily just carn it up a little bit more and be annoying yet again. There is always the chance. They were not winning this one, by the way. He got the stuff that he wanted out. Okay, let's see. A Drencher Gear Gear Hulk. That honestly, again, gives me kind of a chance. Yeah, that does give me a chance. He can't Ugin kill my Jace unless he minus six. Damn it! And I can't f flash this one out, huh? <sighs> Uh, is there anything good that- well, Supreme Will. That's pretty much it. There is a chance we win. We have finally this thing. Oof, that's a lot. Wait, is he just trying to kill me with that? That would be a little bit lame, not gonna lie. Oh my god, you're actually killing me with that, that aren't you? You little shit! Am I dead? I have never seen anyone use this link. Oh god, I'm actually dead, huh? I have never seen anyone use this land as it's intended. I thought it just does some... <laughs> I actually don't know what I expected that land to do. <laughs> I never read it! What do you want me to do? I never read the land. I had no idea what it does. You don't exactly care too much about anything except Blast Zone as a land and a colorless deck. Damn! But yeah, anyway, uh, that's the good old times deck. Oh, Torrential Gear Hulks and a lot. I am so sad I cannot use Glimmer of Genius, by the way, in the main board. But if we made the bl uh, blue-black version of this deck, we probably could and would probably be pretty swell. But anyway, so this was Quizzer Sensen. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the channel. Check out Discord. Check out the everything. And have a nice day. Bye bye.